my, my message to Nigerians, my fellow Nigerians who are doing cleaning job in whatsoever company they are right now, my message for them is that they should not lose hope. First of all, they should be very diligent in their work. They should be very serious and be prompt in whatsoever thing they are doing. Because definitely there's always a hope for a better tomorrow. My name is God Inoge Negweke. I'm from Delta State. I was raised by my grandma because my mom died when I was three. Since then, life has never been easy for me. I never had any hope for the future. Not until a friend of mine helped me and gave me an opportunity to come to Samsung. You know, when Samsung hired me, they hired me as a cleaner. So I was doing my work as a cleaner. I was diligent, cleaning the floor, just doing my work with enthusiasm and, and I was very happy doing my job. So as time goes on, I saw so many people welding. I decided to notice that welding is one of the best skills in Nigeria. So I had passion for welding but I couldn't just go into welding because they employed me as a cleaner. But I was passionate. So as time goes on, they saw that I'm hardworking. So they sent me to the storage where I can issue materials to welders. So when it came as a, a cleaner and see diligence and commitment to activities and the work, and sometimes it's fast knowledge about the things we are doing so compared to the others because we assigned to, to him some tasks which ordinarily it, it means for you to bring on a professional person to do, the, to do it. But to him, when you assign him to those professional stuff, he carried it out as if he had done it before. Because of that, and uh, we see the reason that, okay, he has to be promoted. And our boss, also, with the help of our boss, Gangu Kim, so he said, okay, let him give him an opportunity. If you came in as a welder, the chances of you becoming a foreman is very slight. The chances of you becoming an instructor is very slight. So, but here in Samsung, uh, especially when you're working under a Korean, they tend to see how you work every day, your attitude towards job, your motivation, what motivates you. They just don't only want to use you, but they want to know your personal life about you and how they can help impact you and help you. Before I joined Samsung, I never had any hope for the future. But after I joined Samsung and they've equipped my life with so many skills, I'm not a welder. Everything about me has really changed. What Samsung has imparted into their life in terms of you know securing future, securing you know, life things that ordinarily they, they cannot able to get. So all the people out there, hope is not lost. There is hope. All you need to do, encourage yourself, put more strength, and definitely one day the, the, the help will come to your place. But when the help comes, don't miss it when you are not prepared. You got to prepare first. My message to Nigerians, the young ones, most especially, is should never give up. Yes. Godwin's story inspires a lot of people, should inspire a lot of people. Because he didn't have anything in mind, he didn't have the intention of being uh, an assistant up to this uh, position he is today. Because now, it is not only did he know SMAW, he's impacted with FCAW and partially Argon. And I think with all those things, learning it on your own is good. It could, couldn't have been easy, but with God Almighty, I think, and Samsung Heavy Industries, and to the young ones out there, we have better opportunity with Samsung Heavy Industries. So my, my message to Nigerians is remain faithful and be hardworking in whatever field you are.